Hey viewers! <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Welcome to another game with Casual Pro Gamer. I just restarted because the game was just screwing up so much. But yeah, I'm going to leave that. <laughs> Today we are doing a Riven game, and Riven is going to go Battle Bunny top lane. And um, yeah, the game is still screwing up pretty hard, uh, but well doesn't matter too much well the first time it just I set it to directed camera and it still missed the first kill so let's put it off of directed camera and yeah just go with manual camera because I've never seen a replay miss a kill because how can it miss a kill it has three minutes to realize Oh, there's a kill going on over there, and then it writes the data for the directed camera. And for some reason, it didn't do that correctly. So, Nidalee placing down some traps here. And in the meantime, because this is where we're going to focus for now, this whole team groups up and is going to invade the wrong camp. Because obviously, we are starting off at red. So, uh, raids into red. And, um,. Yeah, they are going to invade blue, being very sneaky about it. And um, Janna is just sleeping on the job. I don't know what she was thinking here. But yeah, guess who's going to be first blood? Oh, 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 right. It was a very easy guess. Yeah, no, I forgot. But yeah, she was first blood. And directed camera just kept focusing here because they were taking damage. And um, yeah, then uh, this guy <laughs> comes in saying, I can take them all because I am Vayne and Vayne is very strong. Yeah, Vayne is not that strong. Vayne is very weak in the beginning of the game. That's why you never see like very aggressive moves from Vayne in the early game. You see very aggressive moves in the late game, even in the mid game, but not in that early game. So anyway, um... Yeah, we're going to just follow around the, uh, the, 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 the uh, ganks a little bit. Top lane currently has no opponent, so I guess she's doing okay. And yeah, can you see how OP he is, by the way? It's, um, it's not even funny, to be honest, because it's this skill that you can just, yeah, you, you just do half... Uh, well, half someone's AP, uh, HP, sorry, in um, in no time at all, because yeah, it has a sec uh, it it works within sec six seconds, and then it has an eight seconds um, uh, cooldown, which of course means you can use it twice in a row within two seconds. So you can you use it uh, then. 5 seconds or 6 seconds later you attack someone and it will do the extra damage and then you immediately activate it again well 2 seconds later which is 1 auto attack later or now 2 auto attacks later you can activate it again so your 3 attacks will do uh, about 50% damage of someone's HP and that is uh, just super ridiculous I mean it is th that is the reason why he is so awesome at this moment well overpowered which doesn't make him awesome in my book but that's why a lot of people play him and why he gets a lot of kills in that early game early mid game um, yeah so Riven uh, getting a kill there and uh, hopefully we will stop lagging here because that would actually be good um, the lags by the way are not caused by my computer I keep saying that but people don't really seem to understand that but there are just some bugs in lol replay that uh, that cause this I don't know why um, it probably has to do with the way that the game is uh, is programmed who's this oh that's Kha'Zix yeah, I don't know really what she does I did do one game of her but yeah we'll lure that soon enough it seems that um, we are uh, yeah going to get a gank off here and grab a blue and let's give the blue to someone who actually wants it yep there we go yeah that's too late dude if you see the javelin flying then you need to react oh oh strong strong she cracked the ground did you see it 
You want me? To, yeah, I'll, I'll rewind that because it was such a strong play. I'll rewind it. So she throws the ball, damaging the ground, and then she's going to pick it up. And she's going to throw it down over here. Do you see the cracks? Oh man, that must have been oh, awesome place, awesome place. Oh right, you don't have your skills now. Oh, how sad. So um, instead of grabbing this kill now, uh, she does grab the kill. <laughs> But instead of grabbing the kill while the guy is still alive, um, because that at least is true, um, yeah, she just wasted the mana and um, yeah, just got the kill way later. Man, I wish it would just stop doing that. So there we go. Come on, let's just QQ her. No, let's not throw him away. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> oh my god. So, yeah. Um, we're going to just uh, go into the non directed camera now. I had a little bit of directed camera going on because uh, of the legs. Because the legs make that uh, that my scrolling actually becomes. Uh, uh, come on, stop that! I want to see the game, not just slideshow. Okay, let's do that again. So Nidalee did run out, uh, rightfully so, uh, and it's coming in, uh, coming back in now. Oh, she misses that javelin. That would have done a lot of damage, I believe. Well, I'm not actually sure how much damage it does at uh, this level, but yeah, well, it's enough. And Riven getting the hell out of there, just running out of turret range, and then coming back in. And yeah, of course, picking up the entire minion wave because that is what we do. So yeah, after that we're going back. So um, it's not very interesting. Was that the top turret? Yeah, that was that was the top turret. Okay, <laughs> I didn't know they uh, they actually attacked it that much that it will actually die to the minions. But well, we are back in the top lane here. And come on, come on, Riven. Riven has a good score by now. 3 and 1. 45 minions against um, Kazix, who is currently at 17 minions. So let's put the junglers here. Then the AD carries, the supports, and the mid laners. So you can see that a little bit better. Uh, it seems that uh, Caitlyn is. Uh, yeah, Caitlyn is just ruling that bottom lane. Both of them at 0, zero, zero only have boots and um, it does seem here that um, uh, Rengar really needs to go home. As a jungler, well as any laner as well, you need to go home more often than you need to, well, heal. Because, um, well, unless you're really bad at playing but uh, or if you're having a really bad game, but that's the same thing. Um, yeah, if you don't spend your money, for example, let me uh, let me show you this case. Uh, this guy has a gold item running. It ha already made him 50 gold. And Rengar, in the meantime, has three kills instead of one. Has more minions, double the minions, but doesn't have that gold item running. Doesn't have any items, so he still only has boots. So he has no increased abilities whatsoever, and therefore is weaker than the Nautilus, even though Nautilus is behind. And that's why you, you need to go back, not because you, uh, well, you n need to heal, no, you need to go back to get more items, sometimes. Not all the time, of course. And hello. Yeah, so a rampage there, 
And uh, Riven is coming back into the top lane. We will go see that in a little bit. Oh, uh, ouch. That is like 20% damage in one javelin. That is, yeah, that's really why she was so popular. Uh, why uh, Hotsha GG liked her so much. She's really just great at doing that poke damage and uh, doing it a crap ton of damage instantly if someone just happens to run into your skill. And most of the times it would miss, but it doesn't matter because she has all of these other skills that uh, that can still make that she actually, well, gets that kill. And here's Riven going to try to steal another blue buff here. And hello. Yeah, she realizes there are two guys there. <laughs> But it doesn't matter. They're just going to go and <laughs> kill them. <laughs> oh man, this must be so painful. Just say, yes, I got Riven. But then immediately... <laughs> immediately getting owned, even in turret range. And, um... Yeah, uh, Nidley knew there was someone in there. So she just threw in a javelin. And maybe he even stepped in a trap, but I'm not actually sure. They are going to grab this uh, this blue buff now, I'm sure. Because yeah, they had the first blue buff, so why not the second one? And there you go, Nidalee once again with that blue buff. Riven obviously doesn't need it. Although the cooldown reduction would be nice, but it's way nicer on uh, on someone like this. So uh, it seems that we got a kill in bottom lane, nothing exciting. And um, yeah, let's just fast forward a little bit. Yeah, I'm not going to follow every single kill because obviously they're just screwing up. It's 2 to 12, so there's not a whole lot that um, the enemies are going to do that is really, yeah, magnificently played. We can already say that. The heal going off and um, yeah, not even near the kill point. She still has plenty of health remaining to actually stay in. And um, Kazix coming in here. Nidalee has to move it out. Yeah, they have to group up a little bit better instead of just standing around. Come on. Yeah, that was nice damage. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> Rengar getting killed because he, sti he stayed there for too long. Oh wow, that heal from Nidalee came in just in time it seemed. Well, I, th I think she first took the shot and then healed, but it did help. Blue team's has been so uh, another turret killed by, uh, come on, Riven, that's her name, by Riven. <laughs> oh man, they're trying to do all kinds of crazy moves, but it's just not working for them. So it's 4 to 13, and they actually did get some kills back. Because 2 to 12 was definitely worse than 4 to 13. Even though it's only one kill less of a difference, the relative difference is better. So still 5k gold between them, so it's not like they're going to uh, catch up anytime soon. They need to take care of the dragon though. Because with the dragon... So if they uh, take the dragon, they should be able to... Uh, to c get a little bit uh, closer to that, but yeah, Riven just having none of it. She just comes in and she's, she says, well, I'll take that and I'll take that. Unfortunately, this guy just gets out. Because Nidalee already threw her javelin and of course, um, yeah, there's, there was really nothing that they could do otherwise. Well, Riven could have used her ultimate on that, her ultimate shockwave thingy. Still don't really understand why why that's called shockwave, but hey, whatever. Maybe she slashes it through the air so fast that it actually produces a shockwave. I don't know. I really, really, truly don't know. It does seem that um, that's pretty, yeah, bad because swinging a sword to the air to produce a shockwave. That is impossible. 
Anyway, um, <laughs> it doesn't even matter, and that's the beauty about it. They can call it whatever they want. Because all it does is just uh, do AoE damage in the cone, so if they would call it the Cone of Death, it would also be good. Wow. Just wow. Okay, so the enemy team is going to retreat. And we are going to just farm up a little, get the buffs. And get into the stop lane. Where she probably doesn't know that someone is in that top rush. No, she doesn't know. Otherwise she would have killed her. Him. It's a him, yeah. Let's let's go for him. So yeah, not a whole lot of excitement for now. This guy is in some trouble. Uh, she runs out. No problem, no problem. Oh, sorry, sorry, I did not see that you actually engaged on that. So yeah, that was uh, pretty easy. And then we of course get uh, the, the, the Kha'Zix, because Kha'Zix is just a very weak champion. Oh, she didn't get him! Oh man, I thought she had him, but she cancelled her auto attack halfway through the animation. But nope, just going to run out. Just recall, man. Oh, okay, or just run through the turret. That's fine too. <laughs> yeah, that's the beauty of those shields, man. You can just do those kind of crazy moves. Shields and heal will get you there. And wow, yeah, four versus two. I think this is going to be a double, but actually, they give uh, give back two kills. No, just one kill, just one kill. But two really low champions now. Yeah, Nidley should have just ran out earlier, but then one of these two would have died. So there's that. Ultimate from Rengar. Is he going to do anything with it? No, he's just going to run out. And Jana. Ooh. Close. Close, close, close. Uh, Riven just pushing the middle lane. Which is exactly what she should be doing right now. She is coming in here now. And she sees this guy coming in. And she sees Rengar coming in. And um, yeah, that should be uh, interesting, to say the least. Is he going to live? Oh, just going to live. And yeah, Riven is just going to distract these guys, or at least attempt to. But it's not going to work. Uh, the flash comes out. And come on, use something. Oh man, he's just going in on it. Yeah, he, uh, he regained enough health there to actually stay alive. Man, because he was super low. But yeah, 15% of your health is regained uh, upon using that skill. I don't even think you have to hit anything with it. I'm not actually sure. I'm not going to look it up either. You can uh, you can look it up. It's one of these skills. I don't know which one. I will look it up later. If I remember. Anyway, uh, for now, yeah, the, the fight is more interesting. So um, let's just see what they can do with it. Riven just, yeah, she has so much health and, and shields and everything. Okay, the ultimate comes out. What are we going to do with it, Miss Battle Bunny? No. Nothing. Okay, that's cool too. So let me look it up then. Uh, heals for 15% of his max health. So no, it doesn't need anything. It's just you need ferocity at 5. Yeah, she's just going to jump out, right? Come on. What the hell? What kind of a path was that? Obviously you run this way. But she tried to run through everyone. 
But yeah, two pools, that makes it uh, pretty impossible to escape. Yeah, anyhow, let's uh let's get it on. As Cupid always says. Yeah, Riven is not going to be uh distracted by that. Um obviously she can kill all three of them. Come on, kill all three of them. Yeah, why not? There you go. Yeah. She um she's pretty fat. She's fourteen and one. <laughs> <laughs> there comes the surrender. <laughs> oh, crazy mode. So, anyway, <laughs> hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. 26 to 8. Oh my god. GG.